What's your opinion on legalizing prostitution? We did it in Australia. Less women are being abused. There's less prostitutes ending up dead. If a prostitute is abused in any way she's not gonna be as scared to go to the police. If you don't like the idea of prostitutes then don't go out of your way to find one. Simple. Make it legal and ensure safety nets for workers to prevent abuse. A just legalize it already. I don't want to stock shelves anymore. It's happening regardless might as well make it safer. To quote George Carlin, fucking is legal. Selling is legal. Why isn't selling fucking legal? Quote. HTTPS. www.youtube.com slash watch. V equals 73 HNG. Underscore JFJ. Underscore K. HTTPS www.youtube.com slash watch v equals 73 hng underscore jfj underscore k decriminalization is the best policy i live in a place where brothels and prostitution are legal with a requirement you register as a sex work business sex worker this saves people from trafficking underage sex work and general violence. Because the police can connect all the dots and know who's involved with what businesses in the event of a crime. I'm all for it. Porn is already prostitution. Those people aren't doing it for the love of sex. So it should all be legal and regulated for safety and health. It's legal here in New Zealand. You do you. Or him. Or her. For a profit. I think people shouldn't be judged based on this sort of line of work. If that's how they want to empower or employ themselves to make money. Good on them as long as everyone is being safe. There's a great book called Revolting Prostitutes written by two sex workers who do also do. Organizing work around sex workers rights. And among other points in the book the critique the Nordic model in which the sex workers aren't criminalized but Johns can be arrested. They think the Johns shouldn't be criminalized. Not for their sake. But because SWs are doing sex work to earn money and are often put at risk from contact with police. Due to immigration status or other issues. They cite studies where to avoid their clients being arrested. They seek out more isolated places for sex which are more dangerous if the John turns violent. So their solution is for both sides of the equation to be legal. With SWs owning cooperative enterprises. Which are often not legal. Where they can be nearby in the same place to protect each other and share in managing the business. Rather than having a pimp, madam that would exploit them. They've pretty much convinced me. As long as lobbyists are legal. There's no reason sex workers shouldn't be. It's not even a question as to which type of whores have done more damage. It is already legal in my country as long as you do not work for someone. It is fine. I don't mind as long as they follow the rules set. And pay their taxes as they do. It should be legalized regulated and unionized. It's going to occur right under our noses, anyhow. Might as well protect these incredibly vulnerable women in every way possible. You can't make a social ill less harmful by making it more harmful. Same as drugs. Same as sex on premises clubs. Same as homosexuality used to be. I live in Australia where it is legal. I lived in New Zealand when it was illegal and after decriminalization. The industry didn't grow in size significantly. It carried on as it always has. Over time, the number of streetwalkers in the riskiest part of the industry has declined to almost nothing. The older formerly organized crime-run brothels have shut and newer venues have taken over. It is just better for everybody.
I have no problem with people using what they got to make a dollar. The problem is so many women are essentially slaves in the prostitution world. That first needs to be addressed. Yes, but under specific codes. Street prostitution should be illegal. But brothels with licenses and health inspections on the regular. Prostitutes have to go through a psych eval and drug test before signing on to ensure that they are not being pushed into this by a third party. Prostitutes have to test regularly for STIs and such as well. Obviously, brothels found to have circumvented these rules should be shut down with owners facing a minimum of 15 years in prison, maximum of life and fines of at least $250,000. Also, those on the sex offender registry at tier 3 or with a history of domestic abuse with risk to Re-offend should be barred from being allowed to utilize brothels. Also, similar to gun stores, brothel operators and workers should be allowed to refuse you service for any reason. While this may leave room for racism or other forms of discrimination, it would reduce the likelihood that some violent deviant gets to abuse a sex worker. It's already legal in Australia. I'm all for it. There are almost no downsides with safe legal access to it. Why not? Prostitution and abortion are similar in this respect. It's either legal and done in a safe and regulated environment or it's done in the back alley in some dude's car. Say yeah. Legalize it.